Yo, my name is Persia Gray. I'm a rapper, singer, songwriter, and producer from Detroit, Michigan. And I was booked to perform on the 2019 Media Matters Soundstage. For me, the event was, it was crazy. It was, it was a new experience. It was my first time being in South by Southwest. It was my first time being in Austin, Texas. So overall, the experience was just wild and fun and exhilarating and just overall, it was just a crazy experience. I got to meet up with some legendary people and some important figures in the industry. So I was really excited about that. As a performer, the experience was, it was refreshing. It was exhilarating. Um, you know, you, you're, you're up there, you're in a, in a room on a stage in a room packed with people and you're just doing your thing and everyone's appreciative of it because everyone is there to enjoy the performance. And then as an attendee, the experience was just as good because the other performers were amazing. That, you know, you're in a room full of other talented people, everyone's vetted. So, you know, making it back knows who they're dealing with. They know, they have a good ear for the artists that they're picking. So every artist that you encounter in that experience, they're usually always 100% dope. Everyone's encouraging every each other and everyone's supportive of each other. So it's a dope experience. The performance led to, for me, it, more connections just in the industry in general. I connected with people from radio, people from media, um, other artists, importantly. Um, I got some collaborations that I'm working on with artists that I met there. And, you know, I've actually did, I actually did connect with quite a few artists that I was able to collaborate with so far. So for me, it was, that was dope. And, you know, I, when I first got there, I got to meet with someone that, um, you know, I was really, really excited to meet with. It was a legendary uh, music exec, music um, icon. And for me, that experience was, was great. But then after the event itself, I got to connect with radio people, media people, other artists. So overall, it was just dope to be able to connect with all of these people that were brought together. When I submitted, I thought that, you know, it would be, it would be dope. I wasn't really, I wasn't really expecting to get booked for it. Um, but you know, I wanted to take the chance because it was something that I've always wanted to do. I always wanted to go to South by Southwest since I started doing music and, and, and South by started like getting popping. So that was always something that I wanted to do. So when I submitted, I didn't think too much of it. When, when I found out I got booked, I was super hype. I called my photographer, Nick, and I called my videographer, Boudreau, and we were on the phone just, we were all excited. I went to Nick's house and we were shoot, dancing out of excitement for the opportunity to be able to go to South by Southwest. So shout outs to Kelby and Making It Mag and everyone there. Since I've been booked, I've been, um, you know, getting together marketing budgets, working on songs and trying to make sure that I can be booked for South by Southwest every year that I'm making music going forward. So thank you, Making It Mag. Thank you, Kelby. And thank you for everything you guys always do.